Westmoreland County, another pizza shop is looking to make a difference in the lives of people. Ross Gadotti is live now with that story. Ross. Hey, Ken, you know, over the last couple of weeks, we've seen Americans uh, getting mad at each other for political reasons, uh, individuals attacking each other over large rolls of, rolls of toilet paper. But we haven't seen a lot of people trying to help each other out. Well, that's about to change. I'd like to introduce you to a man named Rocco. In the midst of a crisis, it's not the complainer that matters, but those who do something positive, like Rocco Pifferetti. We are providing free lunches for anyone under the age of 18 right now due to the uh, school closures. For the last two days, Pifferetti's Youngwood Pizza Shop has seen scores of kids show up to grab some grub. In the back, Piff, as he is known to his friends, and his employees have been knocking out pizzas left and right nonstop. Today we've probably gone through 20. We've probably fed close to 40 students today. We did a little over 50 yesterday. So today we're probably going to beat that. It's greatly appreciated. It's a, it's a big deal. Sarah Vincic brought her kids down to have a bite to eat, but they went off the board. They threw us a huge curve with what they decided to munch on, the following being options as well. I got a salad and a water. A salad? Yeah. It's great that they have vegan and vegetarian options. I got chicken tenders and fries. Now, how much is that better than, let's say, um, peanut butter and jelly? A lot. Oh, I'm with you, Connor, my man. I am so with you. Now, what prompted this entrepreneur to essentially give away the cheese and sauce-covered dough that makes him dough? Well, Rocco, he's a pretty tough cat. He's a boxer, but he's got a soft heart. In a world where people seem to be grabbing more than they need and leaving neighbors hung out to dry in an emergency, We've seen a bunch of that lately, right? Pifferetti is perched on a high moral mountain of mozzarella. Be it pizza, chicken strips, or whatever, it is always better to give than to receive. They've made me successful, so it's time for me to, you know, give back what I can to help them in a time of need. I'm guaranteeing two weeks, and if we can do it longer, we'll do it longer. We're going to be just fine as long as we have individuals like Rocco in the world. And by the way, it is, uh, I think, St. Patrick's Day or something like that. I'm Italian. I don't know much about that. But interestingly enough, it's also Rocco's birthday. So happy birthday, Rocco, and thanks a lot. Reporting live in Greensburg, Ross Gadotti, KDK News. All right. Thanks, Ross.